The world is becoming smaller by the day, especially in the business world. The dynamic development of Southeast Asia has boosted cooperation between these countries and their partners in Europe and North America. New forms of cooperation spanning enormous distances are taking shape. The business of the future. Computers are the vital highway for transferring information and securing communication from company to company. Virtual enterprises, in other words, company networks based on cooperation, will become more and more essential. They will also be supported by information and communication resources. We all are facing new challenges. They come from new kinds of trade, from new kinds of cooperation, and we see the need that the technology has to be changed, has to be adapted. We also see that we have to teach about contractual laws. We have to think about new standards for the communication and for the technology. And therefore, it seems to be necessary to offer a new course. The Technical University of Berlin is offering a new course in global production engineering. As of late 1997, the Technical University of Berlin is offering prospective students a new course, Global Production Engineering, or GPE, as it's known for short. In this innovative course of studies, students learn the fundamental theory they need to equip them to meet the demands of global markets. Entry requirements for the course are a Bachelor of Science or similar degree, as well as a sound working knowledge of English. This pilot course in Global Production Engineering is a three-year postgraduate course. Successful students are awarded a Master of Science degree in Global Production Engineering and the German title Diplom Ingenieur. The first four semesters are devoted to theory. The subjects during the first four semesters are production technology, global production management, energy technology, factory management, Assembly Technology Work Sciences Quality Management and Industrial Information Technology Then there is a complementary group of subjects comprising Methodical Design, International Project Management, Human Resources, Automation Technology, Transportation, and environmental management. To round off the picture, the course includes a segment on technology transfer. This section takes in the industrial history of the Federal Republic of Germany, the economic history of Southeast Asia, contractual law and joint ventures, environment and labor law, technology transfer, organizational theory, and globalization and regional structures. How does the pollution factor 
affect climate? Yeah, the, there are many uh, effects. Uh, In addition to all of this, students are able to learn German, English, and a selection of Southeast Asian languages. The course will mainly be conducted in English and German. In the fifth semester, students go abroad to gain experience working in the field. The contacts they make and their exposure to other cultures are an invaluable experience that helps to instill a global approach. Besides basic qualifications in manufacturing technology, working together in a team in an international team of teachers and students is an excellent chance for a professional career in international companies for all those taking part in these studies at the Technical University of Berlin. The Technical University of Berlin is one of the biggest technical universities in Germany. It has the greatest number of foreign enrollments, including a large number of students from Southeast Asia. The Mechanical Engineering Faculty has a long and successful history in Berlin. More than a hundred years ago, scientists were designing for the future and conducting research here. A century later, the Technical University of Berlin cooperates extensively with other universities, research institutes and enterprises both in Europe and in Southeast Asia. And when it comes to recreation, Berlin is an attractive and exciting metropolis that is hard to beat. Yeah.